So I'm done with that. I'm going to type the word title here. And turn that on. Okay, that's the end of that line there. Let's see if you can see that there. All right, so we are going to resave it. So I do not have to go save as. I can just hit save and automatically put it back in the same places we did it originally. Original time 12. That's page 13. And let's go ahead. I'm going to show you. I'm going to look in our browser and show you how this shows up now. Under body, let's. I'm going to put here a um, sample text just so it's going to have something to show up. We hit file save. Now what we're going to do is open up a browser, Mozilla Internet Explorer, doesn't make any difference. Let's go to start, Internet Explorer, be fine. And instead of going to a web page, www, such and such, we're going to go to our own computer. So we're going to go under file and open. We're going to find a file on our computer rather than on the internet. File open. And then we're going to hit Browse. And we're going to get my case, Desktop, IS-129 Data, Tutorial 1, double-click Tutorial, and there's Dave right there, sitting there, waiting for me to open it up. So I'm going to hit Open, and hit OK. And there it is. Now it's going to give me this little security thing, but we just hit uh, allow block material. It doesn't mean anything. Now here's the text. After I type those seven or eight lines, the only thing that shows up is the um, is the word sample text. Although across the very top, you can see that across that very top, it says Dave's Devil Stick and Larson. Yours should have your last name across the very top. So the process is just keep this open. And let's go back to the uh, notepad, which we should not have closed out. We just minimized it. Here's our notepad. And as we add to that, let me just go ahead under sample text and type, um, I need to hit a paragraph or something. Or this is, I'm going to put additional text. And as I type, and you're going to learn how to do paragraphs and everything and put in images in here and everything, you just go File, Save, just save that same file. Go back to the, across the bottom there, go back to the Internet Explorer or Mozilla. And you're going to then hit Refresh, because we don't need to go File and Open. Again, it's already open. We just need to refresh it. So we just go under View, and here's the word Refresh, or hit F5. And now here's the word additional text. So that's all you have to do. We just go to Notepad, make our revisions according to the textbook, go back to Internet Explorer, hit F5, refresh, and we see what's happening and we see whether it's uh, turning out the way the, uh, it says in the textbook. Okay, so let's quickly go over to page 20. And on page 20 now, you're actually. Okay, very good. Uh, they're going to want you to go in, on our data files and um, find some other things on our web browser. I think you can follow those instruction, instructions on page 20 just fine, I think. And uh, some of the key pages, 40 to 41. I tried to write down some pages that might be uh, important to you real quick. 40 and 41 is... Um, This is um, 41, 42. Oh, that's where you put the image on top. So the image there on pictured on 42, this will come from your data files. So back in Notepad, they will tell you how to insert the um, coding, which will instruct your browser to go back to the um, proper folder and get the file and stick it in there so that it shows up like on page 42. When you're done, they sh your, your final project should look like page 47. 
So they give you a picture there of what the final project is supposed to do, and I do that also. Okay, so let's pretend now that we're ready to upload this. All right. So once you've done this file and you're ready to upload it, we need to go to Blackboard. We say we're done. We're on page uh, whatever, 50, I think we're done. We're done with the information, and then we go back to Blackboard, and the final thing is to send it to me so I can look at it. Go back in Blackboard under the um, course documents. Let's go on down to uploading the file for here. So go on down October 31st, November 7th. Right down here it says to upload your completed HTML assignment. Okay, click here on the blue hyperlink below. All right, so all we got to do is click here. And the only file I need to grade is the Dave.htm file. So at this point, it says uh, upload the file you want. So all we have to do is hit the word browse, attach a file. So this is where you could type something like um, here is, is my Dave.htm file for grading or whatever. Then go to attach a browse. We want to attach a file from my computer. And there's Dave right there. Automatically brings it up. There's Dave. I hit open. And then all I have to do is hit submit. And you have submitted your first assignment, which is the first 50 pages there of tutorial one. So once again, we went down, we clicked this hyperlink. We Put in a couple of sentences. I know who you. I can uh, tell you who you are. I, you don't need to write anything in here if you don't want to. But browse and and just hit that file. Then hit.